because it was the closest we've ever been to losing a whole undercover and it all falling apart. <laughs> uh, you're not looking forward to this, are you? No, I'm not looking forward to it. We I... are! <laughs> <laughs> I can remember how I reacted and I'm embarrassed. <laughs> That's a tease if I've ever heard it. Why don't we take a look? Here it is. <laughs> Alison is on her way here to the Speech House Hotel in the Forest of Dean because she believes she's filming a VT for this morning tomorrow. But there is no VT. It's just a ploy to get Alison to spend the night here because we're going to make her believe that this hotel... Tonight, we'll be working the graveyard shift on our spookiest undercover ever. We've taken over this entire hotel and rigged Alison's room to give her nightmares before she even gets to bed. Everyone is an actor, from weird waiter Nigel <laughs> to eccentric owner Elizabeth. The hotel staff are waiting to give Alison the most terrifying night of her life. Our woman on the inside is Alison's genuine this morning producer, Tamsin, a familiar face who she trusts implicitly. With everything in place, it's time to go... Undercover! Alison's been filming all day. She's travelled an hour to get here, so I'm sure she'll just want to kick back and relax. Unlucky. <laughs> oh, oh, she's oh, here, she's oh. here, she's here. Look nice and busy, Liz, look nice and busy. Thank you. <laughs> right, the Hammond is in the building. Oh, good evening. Hi, Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, do you have a booking with us this evening? Yeah, Alison Hammond. Hammond, did you say? Hammond, H-I-M-M-O-N-D. Let's flick at the lights and you can see the haunted and ghostly. Come. Good. This is an old building and that happens every so often. Dodgy electrics. <laughs> Dodgy electrics, I think. Oh. Yes, OK. Look at this. Look at this. It's been in my family for years, you know, yes. And we've handed it down from generation to generation. I like to keep them here close to me. I like to keep them here close to me, you know. I've got my great great grandmother, <laughs> my great grandmother, <laughs> my grandmother, oh, Stephanie, and my mother. I'll be next. Guess who's next? <laughs> 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 now, you're in room four, okay? There's your key. Thank you so okay, much. Okay, well, thank you. Enjoy your stay. Thank you. Up the stairs and on the left, okay? Right, no lift. No, I'm afraid not. <laughs> Sorry. 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 Not. Is he staying? Is the driver staying? Can we get him to go? We have no control over him. Oh, God. Ugh, I'm not sorry. Oh, she's not happy. Oh, comfy bed. The dogs. I'm so naughty. She just said, it's so, so haunted. haunted. That's right. I'm saying this naughty dream. You see this? Freaking me out, I need to see this. She feels it. Yeah, she's freaked out. What are you going to do? Please, get me out of here. She's not staying. No! Where's she going now? There she is. Can you get any sound up No. It's gone back to our front. She's in the car. Is it in the car? Yes, she's in the car. He needs to be with us, not against us. He wants to take her away. We need to get him on side. The team scrambled to get the driver's number, but if Alison leaves, this undercover is over. So we've got to send in our secret agent, Alison's this morning colleague, Tamsin, to try and get her back. Tamsin and Sandin Deck here. We've got a problem. What's happened? She says it's haunted and she's gone back to the car. Find her and get her to the restaurant. Yeah. Then we can at least have a meal together. OK, cool. Hmm. I know. I'm a million percent I'm not staying here. Oh no, where was happening? Where's your room? Well, oh, oh, on the second floor. Bags, I've got flipping voodoo dolls everywhere. Go on, I can't see. Really? I'm going home tonight. We've got to get her to stay. 
tell that tomorrow morning is a 6.30 start. We're starting at 6.30 in the morning. Are you sure you won't stay? Why is it so early? Look, it's one night. It's one night. Oh, come on, Alison, it's just one night. Yeah, Thank is you. that right? Yeah. But I'm just so tired. Oh. She's thin. Guy's in, guys. Guys, she's thin. She's thin. I mean, none of this is going to call to plan, if I'm honest, so we're just, we're just going with it. Alison has agreed to stay for now, but first we've got to hope she'll get through dinner, as we've got plenty of treats and tricks in store. Thank you so much. You're most welcome. And she's already feeling the spooky vibes. I don't see you. I don't see you. I do. I can not stand you know, him. I've seen Alison on this morning. She's never wrong about these things. Nah. If there's a ghost, she knows. Let's introduce Alison to the next in our cast of Cookie Characters. Here comes the waiter. And just like Tamsin, he's completely under our control. What's your soup of the day? <laughs> the soup is curried courgette. What is the soup of the day? Curried courgette. Oh, where? I'll have the soup. I'll have the soup. Just the I'll soup. Yeah. Is this place haunted? It is, isn't it? Oh, it's definitely haunted. Definitely. I think it's true, right? I've seen lots over the years. I've seen things here. Things that would give you the willies. <laughs> like what? They would give she you the right? willies. Yeah, ma massive willies. <laughs> there is a ghost of a milkman who wanders this place. I don't know if I should say this, but the ghost that comes back most often is a milkman. <laughs> yeah, I just don't want anything to go back away with me, do you know what I mean? All okay. right, I'll leave you back I'll leave ladies. I'll, I'll leave you. Thank you, thank, thank, thank you so much. As the night draws on, the hotel spirits are growing more restless. And by restless spirits, we mean us. Right, let's take things up a little. Alison has already met one set of dead relatives in reception. Should we do it? Yeah, come on. Now we're going to give her a close encounter with another family member. Are we all ready? I can't tell you how excited everyone is about like tomorrow. So yeah, I know it's not ideal, but it's going to be nearly finished. <laughs> don't get a look at you, get your hopes up. Here we go. Here we go. Ready? It literally just fell off. I watched it. Okay. You don't believe this guy's so stupid. Oh, just that. That's ashes there. That's ashes there. It's somebody's body. Me, I think. I feel it. She feels it in her bones. <laughs> I'm, I'm never so sorry. Your, your soup is complimentary. Uh, I'm so sorry. Um, the soup will be complimentary, of course. <laughs> the soup is complimentary! Even he's telling us a free dinner because he knows it's f***ing She's got fruit like the singer! I have a... An infinity with spirits. I can't feel it. You ain't in tune, I'm spiritual. Can you talk to ghosts and stuff? Like, can you talk to ghosts and stuff? Do you want me to ask them to do something else to show you that at least place is haunted? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, spirits, if you're around, show Tamsin that you are around right here and now. Should we flick on the lights a little? Have a little light flicker, maybe? Now. <laughs> 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 Yeah. I know, it's just flicking in front of your very eyes. In front of your very eyes. Come on, let's head up. Yeah. Oh, let me get all my bits. Right, dinner is over. Let's really freak her out, shall we? Come on. this off. Thanks so much. No, thank you so much for dinner. That was lovely. Thank you. With the dreaded dinner done, it's time for the final course. <laughs> We've built a fake wall in Alison's room, complete with a two-way mirror and hidey hole, so we can give her the biggest fright of her life. Big dry day on Wednesday. We've
with sun periods. However, there may be more cloud in the southeast. not holding we put this whole thing on nobody else has checked into this hotel this is all for Saturday night takeaway everything oh my god the best news is you don't have to stay here no you go home now oh my god look at this You were crying, oh. laughing, watching that. Even though... Oh, it's so lovely. Oh, we loved it. Even though you nearly gave us a heart attack at the beginning. I mean, you were in the taxi. Oh, yeah. You were, you were going to go on. Well, in, in my head, and still in my head, that hotel's haunted. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care what anyone says, but honestly, there was no way I wanted to stay there. And then Tamsin came out, and I didn't want to come across as a diva, not staying there. I was like, oh, do you know what? I'll just stay here. Yeah. And I just... Did not want to be there. Honestly, the <laughs> feeling that you created as a team was just amazing. And you did.